Hey everybody, welcome to a new and exciting LP that um, I've actually been trying to figure out where to squeeze into my schedule. And I've been wanting to do this for a while, so, you know, I'm... What the... Oh, okay. Well, that was odd. This is... Skylanders. No toys for Bob. But it's not just any type of Skylanders. It is Skylander Giants. And I think I, I was very happy with the way Skylander Spiral's Adventures came, um, uh, came out when I was doing the LP. So I need to do this one. And I, I did the same thing with this one as I did with um, Skylander Spiral's Adventure. Um, I lined up the newest Skylanders, just the newest ones, and told my son to pick one from each element. And this time, he picked the one which he thought would be um, the best choices for my LP. So, the uh, army of Skylanders I have chosen is again my son's pick. I have no other way to do it. I mean, <laughs> you know, it just, bleh, I have no idea. So, I'm playing this on the Wii U. And on the Wii U, you can also play this game on just the gamepad um, with single player. So this is that option. Like, hey, do you want to play with just the gamepad? This was awesome for my son. I mean, he played a lot of hours on this game just with the gamepad. So, shout out to Wii U right there. Everything you're seeing on your screen now, you can um, choose to see it on the gamepad. Okay? Yes. And volume and all that. Whew, it's awesome. Alright, let's go ahead and just pick, um, I don't know, we'll just pick the top one, I guess. Here we go. Oh, yeah, something new added to Skylander Giants is difficulty. So you have easy, which is easy. <laughs> you have medium, which I think is what Skylander Spyro's Adventure was pretty much set to. So I'm going to set it on hard, because I thought... Um, Spyro's Adventure was really an easier type of game. So, we're going to put it on hard. And a cutscene. Yay! This is actually pretty cool how they brought this back and, um, you know, leads into a good story. But once I start talking, I'm just going to shut up. Right about now. who banished me to this idiot wasteland. Note to self, after I take over Skylands, come back and destroy this place! I'd like to see you try, Chaos. Uh, who said that? Well, well, look what we have here. Mighty Skylanders, frozen with fear in my awesome presence! <laughs> if I could move! I'd be dropping the hammer on you right now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Aw, but you can't, can you? Know why? Because I am a portal master. And you're not. And in case you hadn't noticed, my powers far exceed any of yours. So that explains that. Uh-oh. Shanks. Lord Chaos? Oh, I've been looking everywhere. You seem to be someplace called Earth. I believe it's the homeworld of those portal masters. I've already figured that out, fool. And because of my superior awesome abilities, I am well on my way to devising a plan for my escape. <gasps> and there it is! A portal? Exactly! These foolish human fools have obviously underestimated me! So long, Sky Losers! <laughs> oh, sir, 
I don't know if that's a good idea. I mean, portal masters aren't supposed to use portals on themselves. Silence, Glumshanks! Now, prepare for my triumphant return! Uh-oh. <laughs> 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 Greetings, Portal Master. I am Eon, and I have come to guide you on a great journey. Welcome to Skylands, a magical world of wonder and adventure, protected by the greatest heroes ever known, the Skylanders. You'll see all of these Skylanders in my Skylanders Inspire Adventure playthrough, except for maybe that one. It had long been my duty to watch over the Skylanders and lead them, but this task has been given to you, and now you have found a giant, which is why I have sought you out. Giants were the first Skylanders from long ago, and they have not been seen in Skylands for a very long time. I believe you have found them for a reason. To better understand, let us look back, back 10,000 long years, to a time when Skylands was ruled by an evil empire of robots known as the Archeonians. Yikes. And hence begins chapter one, the time of the giants. And I, I don't really like how they did this. I'll go into that in a minute. But this is what Skylands looked like 10,000 years ago. This was a dark time for Skylands. The peaceful Mabu had been taken from their homes and forced to build massive monuments for the evil Archean Empire. But the iron rule of the Archeans would give rise to a new age of heroes, the Skylanders. Now, place one of your Skylanders on the portal of power. Alrighty, I think I can do that. Alright, so... I'm gonna run through either three or four Skylanders in this video. And... I, I've been going about this all in my head on how I wanted to split this up, and I'm still not completely <laughs> sold on it. So, um, yeah, here we go. We're going to do it with four this one. So, ready? Skylander number one. It's Crush Hour. Is Crusher. Well done, Portal Master. Okay. So we are 10,000 years in the past, and what I'm going to explain to you now is that um, on the gamepad, I can actually see all of Crusher's stats, and if I push a button on the gamepad, I can see all the objectives in this chapter. So, again, more points for the Wii U version if you can pick it up. Crusher is a giant, so giants can pick up these huge boulders and then throw them at stuff, like so. And here's our first special treasure. A wing sapphire! There it is. You'll learn more about it later. We've already learned about these in Sparrow's Adventure. They have pretty much the same purpose. Um, so, obviously, the new thing in this edition are the giants. And Crusher happens to be one. And I already demonstrated, giants can pick up boulders. Which is pretty cool because they do so much damage! Woo! All that damage. There's also a lot of things you don't have to push the attack button for. Such as this, right here. A lot of giants can just walk over things. And they're just so strong and powerful. They're giants! And it doesn't even matter. But I would suggest picking up as many boulders as you can. Because you never know when you have a bounce pad underneath. Luckily, this one led to nothing and nowhere, but that's okay. 
All right. And then Crusher, of course, has his giant hammer. Oh yeah. By pressing the action button. The cannon has returned. Same thing. I always fire it twice. You never know. <laughs> that one just shot over there. <laughs> the turtles are back. Yeah, the turtles are back. It just looks like, I don't know, it looks super funny when a giant pushes a turtle to me. Alright. And of course, we have our treasure chests again. Now, one more note here. Can be found Giants open can open the chests very, very quickly and easily. So it's pretty cool. I, I think they did a lot of cool things with the giant stuff. Like, oh, we're big, we're tough, we're giants. Let's actually give them in-game abilities that make them giant, you know, different. Um, and they, they did a good job with that. I love that. So another thing is their figure is, I'd say, four times the size of a normal figure. So you can actually look at a giant figure and say, yes, this is definitely a giant Skylander. <laughs> yeah! Stay back, you things! I'm warning you! Bone choppy. Bone choppy. All right. Use your attack buttons to defeat so, the chompies. Crusher also has this stone gaze that turns enemies to stone. And then you can just... Oh, my God, that's so much damage. I knew damage. one day help would come, and here you are. Quickly, follow me. All right, Crusher's not really one of my favorite Skylanders. Um, in terms of Listen, usefulness everyone, and power. The Skylanders are here. They're going to free us so we can get home. But Where's he's so that? fun to I use. I know a secret way into the tunnels, but we need you to take care of the guards. My name's Gigantus, and I want to help too. Uh, I might be a little thick-headed, but maybe I can show you a few things. All right, Gigantus. It's good to be giant, because you can do stuff like this. Yeah, but we already yeah! know that. Okay, Skylander, let's go! Alright, and just like all the other Skylander games, you're going to want to break this stuff up because there could be treasure inside. Now, the reason I picked Crusher to start with is because um, I've never really used him a lot, so I don't know what he looks like fully developed, and this will give him a little bit of a starting edge. Because most of his attacks are close range, too, so he's going to take a lot of hits. Yeah. So goes. And we found our first soul gem. This is Shroom Boom. Yay. And I will talk a little bit about Shroom Boom. Yes, we will preview. Shroom Boom is the new life Skylander. And basically, he shoots mushrooms. And the mushrooms, they bounce, they explode. Um, sometimes he can use the slingshot to shoot himself. What you just saw a minute ago was a, a shroom shield, which is, eh, I don't know if it's useful useful or not, it's just, I, it's situational. And Shroom Boom can be a very difficult Skylander to use, but they give you a soul gem right away, so that's kind of cool. Giants are so slow, gosh! Man, I can't believe that soul gem. I'm just going to throw that over there. Here's another cool thing giants can do in certain places. Geronimo! What are you doing, buddy? Hey, wait, wait, don't! Oh, uh, well, there goes Gigantus. Use a giant to leap down and All right. through cracks. First, first impulse is to go over here and do that. Don't. Go this way. And then we have a secret passage over here. We get some more treasure! Yes, we want this treasure all day! Mountains of gold. All right, mountains of gold. Yeah, and they always have puns dealing with their element too. You gotta love that. Um, that's another thing they added to this um, version of Skylanders is all the Skylanders talk now. There isn't any more like uh, robots just like meow, 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 meow. or a wrecking ball just like. <laughs> it actually, you know, says something like oh wrecking ball. Ugh. So I, I don't know if that. It's cute. It adds cuteness. And we got a story scroll. Let's go ahead and read that. 
Despite such snowy conditions, those who reside in the frozen wastelands have never seen an avalanche. Residents are known to throw bombs off the side of the islands in hopes of triggering one. Just to have a story to tell their children, I suppose. Well, that sounds like a smart idea. Ah. So, because I'm Crusher, that means the other Earth Skylander has not been chosen for this Let's Play. And that would be Flashwing. Flashwing is a, uh, a ranged Skylander. And I say that kind of loosely. I mean, it, it's the only Skylander of the Earth element that can actually... Hold on, we're going to Geronimo. Geronimo! Pile oh, pile driver, I'm sorry. And, oh, treasure, treasure, I can't even do it very long anymore. I don't know. Mountains of gold. Um, Flashwing is the first Skylander that actually has, Earth Skylander that has a decent ranged weapon. So that's why I call this it. This is a chomper arranged. An unpleasant place Archeans often put prisoners. Defeat all the enemies in here to open this gate. All right. So in here. They're going to give you some chompies. As a giant, chompies really don't bother you much. Those are one of those enemies you can just walk on. Like, who cares? But if you want to, just have so much fun. Oh my gosh, just hit them with the hammer. Oh, I just love it. I could do this all day. I could really just do this all day. Oh, man. Oh, look at his hammer. He wants some. That's fine. We get him. And in case... Oh, he's froze. Crush! Crush and crush! Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man, that's awesome. I just, I don't know why, but it's just, the hammer is so fun. It's so fun to use. Hey! Up here, Skylander! Just use those bounce pads. Come on! Okay, bounce pads. Got it. Bounce, bounce, use bounce, and I go up there. To reach the top. I can do that. So I was talking about Flashwing. Flashwing is a good Skylander. It, yeah, she is. Um, it's a little on the, uh, I'd say the more feminine Skylander because it's like purplish, pinkish color. And um, one of its moves makes it sparkly and glowy. So it, it appeals more to my daughter than it does my son. So if you do that, you go back in the choppy pit and you're saying, reasonable gamer, what are you doing here? That is so unreasonable. Oh, it's so fun. But there's a purpose to it. Not just because I want to swing the hammer a bunch more, but... Oh my goodness. And as you can see, I'm not taking damage because they're choppies and I'm a giant. Don't even have to worry about it. Okay. I suggest going one more time to the choppy pit. I know. It still seems reasonable, but there's a choppy up here, see? And he's like, oh, don't get me. But then when you go in here, you can't find him anymore. And then his friends attack you. It's an ambush. It's like, I didn't even see it coming. So let's take these all out. Look at that. Look at all this damage. It's like an area effect on chompies. All right. So we find this. This is going to be new to the game. Luckatron wheel. Luckatron wheels, um, well, they give you bonuses a little in the game. Some of them are for treasure, some of them are for experience, as that one was right there. And, and you, you can activate them to just add some more perks to the game. So that's pretty cool. We got to hurry. Please, before we're seen. All right, but first, I'm going to go this way. You need a life, Skylar, to unlock this. These are what the gates look like now. And, um,. I'll talk about those in a minute. First, we're going to switch to our next Skylander. Skylander 2, chosen by my son. Be afraid of the bug. This is Tree Rex. Ah, uh, had a cough. Okay, so Tree Rex is a life Skylander. Tree Rex is also a giant. <laughs> and... The other life Skylander I talked about briefly was Shroombu. Tree Rex, just like Crusher, 
has no worries or concern about choppies. Root runner. Okay, those are those flowers that spawn choppies. Um, there is one more thing they added to this that I can think of right now. <laughs> um, anytime you're in an elemental gate, like right now I'm in the life elemental gate, uh, and you are a life Skylander in that gate, you will start regaining health. At like five health every so often. Um, yeah, it's just a side feature. I've it's never really been a, like a make or break thing for me. So, by the way, you I don't think there's an easy way to get this guy unless you're maybe Shroom Boom could probably shoot a mushroom up there or you know Zook's motor shot. Oh look at it's a present! It's our first present of the game. I'm gonna... <laughs> And, conveniently enough, we get a flower fairy hat. And just like I did the this Skylander's Adventure LP, I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to use the Skylander of the Chosen Element when it is that element indicated in the upper left. And if it's not indicated, then it's my pick. Um, if a Skylander picks up a hat, he must wear that hat. All right, Skylander. That's so, the Archean Conquertron guarding the mine. And then, of course, if one dies, I, I, one keeping us all here. I have to mitigate me, that. He's tough. Whoa. See? <laughs> but if you could just break those chains that are holding him up, Kablamo! We'll be home free. Oh, hey, for Kablamo, I'll do it. But first, we got our air gate here. Air to unlock this gate. Air Skylander. So, my son has picked this one. Bring it the stage. Swarm. Swarm is a Skylander that I did not think I would like at first. Honestly. I, I don't like Swarm's name, but there's treasure in it. Um, just because it's not it's Swarm? Come on. Like, I think I've seen it somewhere online. Somebody suggested Behemoth. That would have been sweet. But one of the cool things about Swarm is um, his second ability is a fly. So, and because the giants normally they walk so slow, this fly is just awesome because it, I, I think it's like a double spell. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm speechless. Turban? That that wouldn't have that would have fit a better a different Skylander a little bit better, but Huh? Sounds like Swarm's happy about it. Whoa. I don't think there's anything down here. I don't know why I went down that way. Get up there. Okay. And then if you push the attack the other attack button while he's flying, you can shoot. So that's pretty cool. And then of course here's an attack. Not too bad. I'm just gonna break all this stuff up. The other Air Skylander that wasn't chosen for this LP is called Jetback. Um, I don't think the he was chosen because he comes with the game. It's like everybody who has the game has Jetback, so it's like, well, why? Um, but anyhow, you could sit here and smash this thing apart if you want to. But if you're a giant, just pick it up. There you go. Uh-oh. I think we made him mad. You have trespassed on the site of our glorious temples. Return to your post at once and resume serving your Archean masters. I, I didn't have a post, though. I was just, you know, just walking, minding my own business. And... You refrain from trying to defeat me. Oh, okay. <laughs> just joking. Bye. Take you out, Choppies. Oh, he's getting mad. He's getting mad. Alright. Let's just fly down here and shoot these guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now, the, of course, the shots aren't as strong as his blade. Stinger blade attack things. So those things do some massive damage. Whew, look at all that damage. Alright, 
So Swarm is actually a, a Skylander I have grown to like, but I don't not I don't like his name. It's just ah, Behemoth would have been so much better. So whoever came up with that, kudos. Undead time. For this one, we are going to pick another one, of course, chosen by my son. After much debate. <laughs> I've got my eye on you. We've actually settled on Eyebrow. And the other undead character, Fright Rider, is um is more of a, a, a charging guy on a the undead element are stronger. Uh, I don't even know what that is. Is that like a chicken or a quasit or I don't know what he's riding, but he's rides some sort of weird creature. Anyhow, there's another <laughs> And it's a paper hat, paper paper fast food hat. Okay, let's see how that looks. Oh, it's got to be painful just sitting on the eye. Gosh. All right. So Eyebrow, of course, he could punch. You've seen that. Oh, he can get a spike through the junk. And if you push the Y button, the eye comes out and can shoot lasers. Yeah. That's kind of weird. But the strange thing about Eyebrow is if the eye pops out, the body is defenseless. So something can go over there and start hitting you in the stomach or whatever and you take damage from that. I don't think the eye takes any damage. I think it's just the, the body. Alright. So let's bounce up here. Alright. Where are we at? Oh! I'm not even going to go that way. I'm going to break these barrels and go down this way. Peace. <laughs> ah. And this is our legendary treasure. Yay! It is a Starry Night paint job. What does that mean exactly? Uh, I'll explain later. Okay. So that is all the objectives we we need to grab. I'm just double checking, you know, all the stuff here. I will destroy you sequence. Oh, good sequence to initiate. I'm just gonna pull your chain. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Alright, so let's move on with Eyebrow. Oh no, they're getting mad. He is so slow, gosh. Oh, enemies. Pew 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 pew. Oh, don't attack me. Pew 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 pew. Alright. And then there's the body attacks. They're so much stronger, too. Eventually, if you upgrade the eye a lot, the body won't be defenseless. It'll start punching and swinging and kicking and stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh oh, the getting angry sequence. I wasn't expecting that. I'm gonna check over here real quick to make sure. I don't think there's anything over here, but. Yeah. Eyebrow. I do not like him so much because he's so slow. So slow. Where I don't oh, he shot me. Whereas Sprite Rider is awesomely fast and has like an awesome charging Falling spirit. Seconds. <laughs> oh, this, these games are so hilarious. Run! Quickly, back to our village. By the ancients, we're thank free. Thank you, Skyland. Yes, thank you. You have given us hope. Perhaps now, with the help of the Skylanders, we can finally bring down the Archeans so all of Skylands can be free. So yeah, that's supposed to be, what, 10,000 years in the past? And the, the weird part is, you can bring in any Skylander you want, even from Skylander Spiral's Adventure. So I don't know if I really, you know, really like that first level, because it's just, it's weird. So now all the Skylanders are now available, and it's, you know, before they were here 10,000. Okay, anyway, that's the end of the first video. Next time... We'll do chapter two, and we'll try to stick with one chapter, one video. Okay? Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy it.